Good morning. This is the Ramblings of an Undisciplined Mind podcast for Thursday, November 5th, 2015. Oh, the words were not coming very easily this morning. I, um... Yeah, I did more. I did more yesterday. Yeah, and yesterday I got up. I actually got up. I I've set my alarm a half an hour early, earlier than usual. So that has me getting up at four thirty, ish. Yesterday I woke up like just before, and what what happens is it really goes off at four fifteen, and I smack the snooze button a couple times, and. I actually woke up at like, I don't know, 4.10, 4.05, and when the alarm went off, I was just like, uh, okay, I think I'm just awake, so I went ahead and went downstairs. I actually got, you know, in addition to the half an hour earlier I set my alarm, I, you know, I had another, what, 15 minutes earlier than that, and uh, I got downstairs, and I'm looking at the interwebs, and I'm looking at YouTube, and the next thing I know, 45 minutes have passed, I'm like, oh crap, I gotta write, so I started writing, and I got 1,500 words done in, uh, I don't know what the math was, probably about an hour, this morning it was all I could do to get 1,000 words thousand words done I didn't I didn't uh, I didn't wake up early uh, I also kept my time on the interwebs to a bare bare minimum I think I, I looked around at stuff for about 15 minutes and then I got to writing but yeah the words just were not flowing this morning at all uh, well they started flowing toward the end which is typical about the time I had to stop writing to to go get ready for work is the time when the words started flowing. So, yeah, that's kind of my luck. That's kind of my luck. But, you know, it's coming along. It's coming along. I'm over 13,000 words now. Um, it is kind of funny because people were like, you know, when they were seeing me rack up these 3,000 word days like, oh my gosh, you're going to totally kill 50,000 words. And I'm like, well, maybe. I typically write more than 50,000 words. But the other reality is I know there's days where I'm going to be hard-pressed to, you know, make word count. You know, so you're supposed to do, what is it, 1637, I think, is the number of words you're supposed to write today. So I'm, I'm 600 words short. And so right now my intention is when I get home from class tonight, which will be around 8.30 at the latest, 8.15, is that I will um, probably try to sit down and crank out another 600 words, which should be about a half an hour, maybe, um, with at my current writing speed. And, uh, you know, so I, that, that's my plan. You know, if I don't get it done, then I live with just a thousand for today. That's okay. That's why I did the big push at the beginning. And I'll have a big push at the end because I got more days off work or wrapped around Thanksgiving. Um, you know, so I will have, I've got times where I can, I can catch up a little bit, um, Surprisingly enough, I'm I'm a little worried about Saturday. <laughs> I just I, I just got reminded yesterday that Spectre comes out Saturday, and I really want to go see Spectre. Plus, I want to move my desk up to the man cave. Um, that, that probably won't take all day. I don't know. I got to kind of disassemble it to get it up there. Yeah, so it's gonna it's just bigger than just pick up a piece of furniture and move it upstairs. It's it's uh, kind of big and ungainly and in a weird shape. So I think I got to kind of take it apart um, to a certain extent. So, and then we're going to my daughter's house to, to visit, my daughter's apartment to visit in the evening. And there's a Michigan football game in the middle there too. So, you know, there's kind of a lot going on. Kind of a lot going on Saturday. But I, I got to find some time to write. Maybe I should get up early. Hmm. There's a thought.
I'll have to think about that. I will have to think about that. The thing I thought I'd talk about today, it was something that I um, I kind of forgot about. I mentioned this, this patio book before that was about this guy trying to figure out um, what to write for NaNoWriMo. And I've looked it up here. It's called Right Now with a W. The Prisoner of NaNoWriMo uh, by Craig somebody. I have to click on the link to see who, who wrote it. Um, if you just search Patio Books by Craig Robertson, if you just search for, for NaNoWriMo on the Patio Books site, you'll find it. It's the first thing that pops up on a Google search. And this guy used to, would go into these, you know, in this book, and it's a farce, you know, so don't read this thinking that it's in any way, shape, or form kind of a serious documentary of one writer's experience in NaNoWriMo. No, it, it, it is a, a, a fantastical farce, and, 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 you know, probably one of those things that only if you've done NaNoWriMo would you really appreciate fully. But, uh... So this character will go into these, you know, fugue states, I guess. I don't know, where he's envisioning potential plots and all this stuff. And I'd forgotten about that aspect of NaNoWriMo. Uh, and I'm calling it the Nano Funk, Where just at odd bits, I could be listening to a podcast. I could be, you know, watching TV. It doesn't really matter what it is I'm doing. Um, some idea or some thought about my book will pop into my brain and I'll spend however long internally workshopping it. Oh, I could do this and I could do that. Maybe if I did this, and I kind of need this element. And, and then I'll kind of wake up and go, oh, I'm listening to a podcast and I just missed the last five minutes or two minutes or whatever the case may be. Um, Yeah, I'm not aware that I've done that when I'm like talking to people, but I won't rule it out. Um, my problem now is is that I've got I've got uh, nano funk in my head, done to the tune of uptown funk. Yeah, so I've got that chorus. You know, nano funk's gonna give it to you. Nano funk's gonna give it to you. Don't believe me, just write. <laughs> so I've got this in my head, and I'm and I'm trying not to write lyrics for it because that's not the point of this month. I don't need to be writing lyrics for a song, although I am tempted to maybe think about doing that in December because it sounds like fun. I haven't done a crazy karaoke in a while. Oh my gosh, people, get out of the way! Traffic is... I haven't even made it on the freeway yet. Traffic is just... I don't know what's going on up here. We are just crawling. So, so yeah, that's... You know, I, I kind of got that in me. You know, I got the, the beginning bit. ba ba da ba ba da no You know, I got that in my head. I was thinking about that in the shower. It's just like, get out of my head! So I guess my earworm for today is Uptown Funk, but with the words redone to be, you know, NaNoWriMo specific, but, you know, uh, I do kind of want to do that. It does sound like fun. Uh, anyway, yeah, so the Nano Funk. So if you got somebody in your life besides me that's doing NaNoWriMo and you see their eyes glaze over, you know what's happening. It's Nano Funk trying to figure out plot or character or all of the above. Um... Holy crap, really? I mean, this light was green for like half a second, and now it's red. Wow. All right, anyway, um, I think I was signing off. I'm going to see if I can handle this traffic um, without talking on a podcast. So I'll be back tomorrow, and I'll be talking to you then. So, be seeing you.